Hi students, welcome to Engineering Graphics. I am Dr. Vinod Kumar. This is video perspective 10. In this problem, in this video we are going to discuss a problem that has come for KTU in May 2016. May 2016. May June 2016. It's about a pentagonal prism. A pentagonal prism lying on the ground. Like this. A pentagonal prism lying on the ground on a rectangular face with the front pentagonal face touching picture plane. If this is picture plane, if this is picture plane, it is touching picture plane. Agree? This is the this is the prism. Now we will use visual drawing method to draw this. Therefore, I draw picture plane. I have to draw the plan of the prism. Before drawing the plan of the prism, I draw HL here, GL here, and I draw a pentagon. I draw a pentagon. Whose side is 25 mm? This is the 25 mm side pentagon. This is actually the elevation I am drawing. Then 30 mm above, I draw the HL. I have drawn the HL and GL. Now, take this width and draw the plan. Draw the plan of the prism. Draw the plan of the prism. This is projected from this. Okay. I hope you understand. I call this A dash, B dash, C dash, D dash, E dash, F dash, G dash, H dash, I dash, J dash and this is A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J. Now, where is the station point? Station point is 75 mm to the left of the axis 75 mm to the left of the axis and 55 mm in front of it this is this is a speed so that this is a speed up I am going for visual drug method I am going for visual drug method ok now I join all points of the plan I mean all points of the elevation a speed dash. I have joined all points of the elevation to a speed dash. And all points of the plan to a speed. These are the intercepts. Intercepts. Drop them. Drop the intercept of F to A dash. This is A dash of AF. A dash of dash. F. G. H I J Now, since the front pentagonal face is touching picture plane, this elevation itself is the perspective of the pentagonal face. Since the front pentagonal face is touching picture plane, this itself is the perspective of the Front pentagonal face. Now, once you have got those points, G, this intercept of G is different. This is the intercept of G. G. Now you can connect F G.
you have got the pentagonal prism lying on the rectangular face with the front pentagonal face on PP. What does it mean? It means that instead of naming A dot, P dot, C dot, etc., you could have marked capital A, B, C, D, E. Because those points themselves finally become the perspective of the front pentagonal face. That would have been better than writing A dash, B dash, C dash, etc. But for concept, when you are drawing elevation, you have to mark A dash, B dash. That's why I do that. Now, listen very carefully. If you pull the prism back by some distance, pull the prism back by some distance, what happens? You will have A dash, B dash, C dash, D dash, E dash here, very light. And just behind that, just behind that, you will have capital A, B, C, D, E obtained from the intercepts of this point. This point will be behind. So when you join those points to SP, you will get intercepts. Those intercepts will have to be dropped. Just like the way you have dropped the intercepts from these points to get these points, the front face which is behind PP will have intercepts. Those will have to be dropped to get capital A, B, C, D, E. So A dash, B dash, C dash, D dash, E dash will remain. Just behind that you will have capital A, B, C, D, E which is a slightly smaller pentagon. Here, since that front face is touching with a plane, that pentagon doesn't come. The elevation itself becomes capital ABCDE. When it is pulled back, in addition to the elevation which is very light, A dash, B dash, C dash, D dash, you will have capital ABCDE which represents the perspective view of the front pentagonal face. Now, similar to this, you have hexagonal prism touching with a plane and again pulled back behind with a plane. Square prism touching with a plane and pulled back behind with a plane, triangular prism, anything can come. This is the basic principle. You have to first of all draw the elevation, from the width draw the plan and proceed like that. But if station point comes nearer to, nearer to this area, it is not very wise to go for visual drive method. You may have to go for mix up, mixing of the two methods or vanishing method. I hope you understand. Okay. This question is extremely important. This has repeatedly come for all your messages. Okay. Thank you.